Here we are at science lab. Just we completed the second lesson, living organism. After completion of this lesson, we are here to observe the some museum specimen. And here we have the first one is the jellyfish. So let us classify on which kingdom does it belongs? Animalia. Okay, it belongs the kingdom Animalia. As we know, it does not have a backbone. So its sub kingdom is Invertebrata. Invertebrata. And the phylum is Cylindrata. The phylum is Cylindrata and its types is already jellyfish. And its character it find in marine. It means these animal are totally find in marine. Means ocean. Okay. Here we have the other medium specimen that is octopus. Here it is also it does not also does not have a backbone. So kingdom is animalia. It is a animal, so it falls under the kingdom Animalia. And it does not have backbone, so its uh, sub kingdom is Invertebrata. Likewise, its phylum is Phylum is Mollusca. And similarly, it is also marine animal. It means it finds in ocean. Here we have the next one that is starfish. Here we have next one starfish. So, Again, a starfish is also animal, so it falls in the kingdom animalia. animalia. Sub kingdom invertebrata. Good, invertebrata and phylum phylum echinodermata, and it is also marine animal. It's found in ocean. ocean. So here are the three museum specimens that are totally found in marine, and they all are belongs to what invertebrata. It has a different Okay, here we have a next museum specimen. Recently, we observed a few museum specimen with other strands, and here again we are going to observe the other museum specimen. Uh, so again, this is the crab. First of all, we have to identify this one, and it is crab. We identify that one, and let us classify this living organism. So, which kingdom does it belongs? Animalia. It belongs kingdom Animalia, and sub kingdom. In vertebrata, which sub kingdom? In vertebrata, phylum arthropoda. Phylum is arthropoda because having a six legs, that's why it falls under the phylum arthropoda. And it has also four class. So it belongs to which class? Crostia. It belongs to class Crostia. And its types already is a crab that we know very well. Uh, it can find both. Uh, in water and land. Here we have the other museum specimen that is types of this is fish. Yes, it is a fish. Uh, normally it, is, it can be found anywhere. Uh, so let us classify this fish. Which kingdom does it belong? Animalia. Animalia. It belongs to kingdom Animalia. Animalia. And sub kingdom is Crodata. What? Crodata. And uh, its phylum is that? Vertebrata because it has a bone. Yes. It has a bone, so it falls under the vertebrata. And its class is fishes. What? Fishes. Its class is fishes. So and normally it is found in water. Because and it respires because of presence of gills on it. Okay? It can respire because of gills. So it can survive in water. So here we classify some living organism after the completion of the uh, second lesson that is the classification of living organism. 